Look around you. More and more incredible things in construction projects appear in the era of technological progress. Unmanned vehicles, both cars and trucks, incredible aircraft are equipped with the latest fashion, but what is even more surprising and compelling are modern cruise liners. On the night of April 14 to 15, 1912, the Titanic sank. At that time, it was the largest ocean liner in the world. Today, the Titanic would not even enter the top 50 largest passenger ships. Modern liners are much larger and much more luxurious. We have prepared the top of the largest and coolest cruise ships in the world. In fifth place, Ada's Ada Nova cruise ship was built in 2018 and has a length of 337 meters. The ship can accommodate up to 6,000 passengers in cabins. The number of staff is 1,500 people. To ensure that tourists do not get bored during the trip, the ship has shops, restaurants, a water park for children and adults, an indoor bike rack, a bath complex with five types of saunas, a spring park, an obstacle path of various difficulty levels, a quest room, and much more. Concerts and performances are held here every evening. The vessel travels around the Mediterranean, so there aren't any long cruises on Ada Nova. On average, they last up to eight days. Ada Nova is a favorite of environmentally friendly cruisers, as the ship operates exclusively on liquefied natural gas. This is the very first ship with an environmentally friendly fuel source. Fourth place, the Spectrum of the Seas. With the start of cruises from Shanghai in May of 2019, Spectrum has become the largest and most expensive ship in Asia. Capable of carrying 4,246 guests, the liner is 347 meters long. On the spectrum of the seas, each cabin, even the inside, has a sea view. The virtual balcony system in the internal cabins in real time shows guests the view of the ocean or port, which gives the impression of a real feeling of open space. Skypad is a unique trampoline with virtual reality technology. Using VR glasses, you can transfer to another place, time, or planet, as well as simulate jumping into the stratosphere and flying into space. Admiration is also caused by the entertainment center Cplex, a transformer room that changes its purpose in literally minutes. It is simultaneously a roller dome, a basketball court, a go-kart, and circus school. Cplex also has separate outdoor areas with a wind tunnel, a surf simulator, and a skeleton. The third place is shared between two ships at once. They are exactly the same. The length of the vessels is exactly 360 meters. They can accommodate 6,780 passengers and each have 2,742 rooms. At Allure of the Seas, it's Central Park, which impresses with a variety of live exotic plants right on the ship. On the upper deck, there are two Flowrider surf simulators, climbing walls, a golf course, basketball courts, and bowling. For guests of the liner Oasis of the Seas, bungees were made on board the ship, which descend to a height of nine decks and allow you to feel the real pleasure of free flight. At Oasis of the Seas, you will find an ice rink, a surfing simulator, two climbing walls 13 meters high, huge pools, a basketball arena, and much more. As you may have guessed, both ships are for outdoor enthusiasts. In second place, Harmony of the Seas is the largest ship in the world in almost all respects. Its length is 362 meters, it weighs 226,000 tons, and its capacity is 6,867 passengers. The only thing the liner is inferior to the absolute leader is the number of rooms. There are 2,747 rooms on the Harmony of the Seas liner. Abundant on board the Harmony of the Seas liner, a water park with water slides, surf simulators, a climbing wall, an amusement park, zipline bungee, and the famous Ultimate Abyss slide where you can slide on a special pillow from deck 16 by 6 in just 14 seconds. On the liner, you will find more than 20 restaurants and bars, the most famous of which is the innovative Bionic Bar, where cocktails will really make you work for them. Almost all liner routes are transatlantic, therefore they cost more. 
The starting price of the trip is 1,000 euros per person. And finally, in first place, Symphony of the Seas is a record holder among marine giants. This 18-deck ship accommodates 6,780 passengers and 2,175 crew members. His first cruise took place in March of 2018. Symphony of the Seas is the largest ship in the world. Symphony of Seas is divided into seven cities, arranged in a certain style of districts. Such an organization of space is a peculiar feature of the Oasis class, and passengers really like to study the features of each city. Like other liners of this class, passengers can enjoy the extensive infrastructure, spacious central park with living plants, rides, musicals, aqua theater, water theater, the longest slide in Ultimate Abyss Fleet, surf simulators, a basketball court, and an ice rink were built on board. The liner is characterized by many accommodation options, from cozy interior cabins with virtual balconies to luxurious two-level suites. There are also 20 restaurants on board, including star chef Jamie Oliver's restaurant. Almost all routes of the Symphony of the Seas run along the coast of America. Seven-day trips cost about 900 euros. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please share with your friends and family, and let us know what you think in the comment section down below. Thank you.